welcome to network nuts youtube channel i am alok shrivastava and in this video we are going to understand a very important topic uh, with respect to the terraform certified associate certification also how can we use multiple instances of a provider while creating a terraform resource look uh, practically <coughs> excuse me there might be times when you need to specify multiple instances of the same provider let's suppose uh, from a terraform file you intend to create one server in us and say another server in india right but you don't want to create two separate files for the provider block so how can we use that so if we want to create aws resources in more than one regions we will be needing multiple instances of a provider let's suppose the web server is running in india and the database server might be running in the us so terraform supports the use of an alias meta argument right which enable me uh, to give a provider alias for a reference so let's try doing this i'll give you an example say i create a file here i call it multi instance or multi region let's call it multi region dot tf it's a terraform file here so first i create a provider normal provider aws right and say i choose my region as uh, ap south one mumbai ap south one is the region the default one right and then i i create another pro uh, another provider i give aws and say this time i specify the region say virginia so i give us east one right that's my provider and i have to give a alias this is what i want you to understand so all the providers support the use of an alias meta arguments which enable me to give provider a alias for a for a reference say i call it usa say usa that's all so now i have got two provider definition one is without an alias and another is with a alias so i i had intentionally not given an alias for the uh, mumbai i'll tell you why now let me create a resource here i'm going to create a web server a simple web server resource aws underscore instance i give it say india server i call it india server and then i will be requiring some ami the bare minimum is i need the ami and the instance type right so let me take uh, get a ami id from uh, amazon so i open my browser i go to my dashboard here aws console login in yes supply your credentials obviously so here we are i will just i am in the virginia no nope. right so first i go to mumbai let's go to mumbai and i just need to pick one ami id that, that is all so i click on the ec2 no running in, uh, instances that's great okay i just click here I, i just need to pick the first ami right that's all i need this because i hope you know that the amis differ from region to region so that's it so i paste it here ami id and i call it the instance type i said t2 micro will be good right i call it t2 micro right that's all so i hadn't specified any region here now i create another resource resource aws underscore instance i call it usa server right i can also call it a virginia server now i need to go and fetch a ami from virginia as you know that the amis differ from region to region so the same ami number might not be available in virginia so i have to explicitly go there and just get this value so okay i am in virginia that's the one i copy this one that's all i paste it here and i'm not bothered about the instance type so i give use the t2 micro right that's wonderful but here because i want this instance to be created in uh, virginia so i have to specify here provider it's very simple guys aws dot usa it, it means the syntax is 
the region dot alias that is the syntax right provider name dot alias so in my case the provider name is aws and alias is usa that's it that means i want this particular instance to be created in this provider provider this and because i hadn't specified any provider here so this will obviously be getting the default one right guys so this server i should have one server created in india and i should have another server created in usa from the same file so here the catch is i'm using providers multiple times right that is it so instead of creating two separate files you can use this so this is a very uh, important topic from your uh, uh, terraform certified associate uh, examination also right there might be a scenario based question for that now if i save and come out uh, it's always a good practice to check the syntax i do a terraform validate hope everything is fine wonderful guys if i do a terraform plan so this is going to check what is in the plan right so two resources will be created let me check one is going to be in the us with this ami and another one is going to be in india let's apply it now if i do apply i i should have two resources in different regions from the same terraform file with multiple providers that's the point that i want you to understand so multiple instances of a provider can be specified using the aliases so i just need to give a yes here and let's go to mumbai and first check it there i go to mumbai in the meanwhile i think it's coming up yeah it's creating wonderful let's finish it first let's wait and we are doing it so uh, like uh, terraform certified associate is a very good certification and anyone who is watching this video uh, it, it, it means you are already comfortable with amazon web services as the cloud platform the now the next step obviously should uh, should be to move on to the iac infrastructure as code so i wanted to share this as this is a important topic from the tca exam terraform certified associate let's wait and then we will check it i hope i should go and check it should be created and then let me go and check it out i go to the services i go to my ec2 i'm in the mumbai re yeah see here one instance is running up fair enough this is running up now if i go to mum uh, virginia i should have one more instance running there also perfect guys that's it so that is what i wanted you to see and if i give a terraform state list i should be able to see it yes both the servers are running and one is in india and another one is in us based on the file so we here we learned how to use multiple instances of a provider using aliases that, so that's was a short and a, a very kind of a up to the point video i hope you liked it and i'll see you soon thank you very much bye bye godspeed and yes before i do a godspeed you sh if you are doing a test environment you should never forget to do a terraform destroy this is going to destroy all the infrastructure that we have just created right so it is always good to give a destroy and then i can safely say you got speed take care so if you wish just stay for a while and let it finish yeah i just need to do a yes to our destroyed so oh, that's good that's an important topic So that's all guys for this week for this video and fi like finally it's the time to say goodbye god speed take care be safe bye bye